In last class, I have discussed about the these parts are not called the root stem. Now we are discussing about the leaf. Morphology of leaf means characteristic features of external characteristic features of leaf. Okay. In last class, already I told you leaf has three main important parts. First one, leaf base. Second one, video. Third one, lamina. Third one, lamina. These are three important parts. Okay. In last class, we have discussed about first part of the leaf, that is leaf base. That is leaf base. Okay, Abdul. This is the leaf base. Leaf base. Next, second part is the petiole. What is petiole? How can we define? Yes. How means? Petiole means stalk of the flower. Stalk of the flower is called petiole. Is called petiole. After it, this is the stalk. This is the stalk. This stalk is the PTO. Understanding. Actually, it is present between the. It is present. Between the leaf base and lamina, the entire structure, plant green color, the entire structure is the
step down root stem morphology of root and stem was completed in last classes now we are discussing about the leaf leaf has three main parts first one leaf base second one petiole third one lamina in last class we have discussed about the leaf base structure of leaf base functions of leaf base and different types of leaf bases in different plants like legume plants next to onion next to some poesy members like this we have discussed about different types of leaf bases now let us discuss about the second part of the leaf that is the petiole that is petiole <coughs> what is petiole petiole means nothing but star of the star of the leaf as again the star of the leaf is called the petiole as a for example this is the leaf this is the stalk this is the stalk of the leaf that is why this is the petiole this is the petiole next leaf base and lamina these two are two parts this entire plant green color structure is the lamina or leaf blade lamina or leaf blade between these two parts petiole is present means petiole is present between the leaf base and lamina leaf base and lamina okay yes next what is the function of the petiole the function of petiole is to expose the lamina to sunlight lamina has to be exposed to sunlight lamina has to expose expose to sunlight because it performs the photosynthesis process that is why okay so petiole exposes the lamina to sunlight and it helps the lamina to get the sufficient sunlight sufficient sunlight okay next length of petiole varies from species to species length here varies some leaves of some species have long petioles some leaves of some species other species have short petioles some have no petioles means no petioles are present in some plants means sessile leaves are present there there are sessile leaves okay 
Yes, observe one second. Next, third body is Damina or Leaf Blade. Damina or Leaf Blade. Flat structure, flat green color, white structure, white structure of leaf is called. Structure of leaf is called lamina. This entire structure is called lamina. What? Lamina. You know, the color of the lamina is green color. Maximum. Lamina is a green color. Okay? Green color. What is the reason for this? The reason for the green colorness is chlorophyll pigment. What? Chlorophyll. Pigment. Ask you carefully. Chlorophyll pigment. Due to presence of chlorophyll pigment, lamina is in green color. Okay. This also responsible for the photosynthesis process. So, what is the function of the lamina? Function of lamina. Function of lamina is photosynthesis. What? Photosynthesis process. This is the main function of the lamina. Okay. What is happening in photosynthesis? In photosynthesis, in the presence of sunlight, in the presence of sunlight, carbon dioxide molecules are combined 
आठ फॉर्म ग्लूकोज आठ फॉर्म ग्लूकोज ग्लूकोज इज द फॉर्म ऑफ ए सिक्स फैट इक्वल ओ सिक्स इज द फॉर्म ऑफ द केमिकल फॉर्म ऑफ ग्लूकोज here are the species means how many carbons are present six carbons from where these six carbons from where these six carbons came actually from the carbon dioxide from the carbon dioxide six carbons present in glucose okay okay means six molecules of carbon dioxide are combined together and form a glucose molecule during the photosynthesis process this type of very valuable life process occurs inside of the lamina instead of the lamina are you understanding observe carefully next next in lamina some specialized skeletal like structure is present lamina has skeletal like structure okay skeletal like structures what are they they are actually leaves they are leaves what leaves observe at the center of the lamina a prominent large wheel is present this prominent large wheel is called midrib what it is called actually midrib from midrib some lateral small wings are developed these are the lateral wings lateral wings are again classified into small small wings these are the Winglets. They are called winglets. Means are made of the lamina. prominent largest wheel is present largest wheel is present this car It is called 
मेडे मेडे इसका मेडे लेटर विंस विंस लेट्स एंड मेडे कलेक्टरली फॉर्म इन a skeleton like structure of the lamina and they give the mechanical support to the lamina mechanical support to lamina mechanical support अब जब
Next, another important one. Important one is acid. The important one is. Acid. What is acid? Acid means what down to this is a stem. Here again, this is a liquid. What else can I tell you? Very important is to imagine and love. Our angle present between the angle present between the angle present between the leaf base and. The angle present between the leaf base and the stem. The small angle is called axis. This axis has a axis has a small bird-like structure. This bird is called. Axillary bud. Axillary bud. What is the use of axillary bud? It can be developed as a branch or a leaf or flower. Okay. Observatory important one. This is here on either side of the on either side of the leaf base. A small hair-like structures are present. Small hair-like structures are present. These are called stipules. These are called stipules. In some plants, stipules are present. There are called stipules. Stipules are present. There are stipules. Stipules are absent. There are unstipulated. Other stipules. There are small microscopic hair-like structures. There are small microscopic hair-like structures. Okay. Yes.